Muslim, Wikipedia article audio. 65-75% Sunni Islam, 10-13% Shia Islam, 15-20% Non-Denominational Islam, 1% Ahmadiyya. Qualifier Lexicology Meaning Other Prophets Demographics Notes A Muslim is someone who follows or practices Islam, a monotheistic Abrahamic religion. Muslims consider the Quran, their holy book, to be the verbatim word of God as revealed to the Islamic prophet and messenger Muhammad. The majority of Muslims also follow the teachings and practices of Muhammad as recorded in traditional accounts. Muslim is an Arabic word meaning submitter. The beliefs of Muslims include, that God is eternal, transcendent and absolutely one, that God is incomparable, self-sustaining and neither begets nor was begotten that Islam is the complete and universal version of a primordial faith that has been revealed before through many prophets including Abraham, Ishmael, Isaac, Moses, and Jesus, that these previous messages and revelations have been partially changed or corrupted over time and that the Quran is the final unaltered revelation from God. The religious practices of Muslims are enumerated in the five pillars of Islam, the declaration of faith, daily prayers, fasting during the month of Ramadan, almsgiving, and the pilgrimage to Mecca at least once in a lifetime. To become a Muslim and to convert to Islam is essential to utter the Shahada, one of the five pillars of Islam, a declaration of faith and trust that professes that there is only one God and that Muhammad is God's messenger. It is a set statement normally recited in Arabic, L.A. with Makran ilha ilhum yuamadun raslu L.A. with Makran H. There is no God but Allah, Muhammad is the Messenger of God. In Sunni Islam, the Shahada has two parts, La ilaha illallah, and Muhammadun Rasul Allah, which are sometimes referred to as the first Shahada and the second Shahada. The first statement of the Shahada is also known as the Tal. In Shia Islam, the Shahada also has a third part, a phrase concerning Ali, the first Shia Imam and the fourth Rashid Caliph of Sunni Islam, which translates to Ali is the Wali of God. The word Muslim, English, slash mzlm slash, slash mzlm slash, Slash MSLM slash or Muslim slash MZLM slash slash MSLM slash is the active participle of the same verb of which Islam is a verbal noun, based on the triliteral SLM to be whole, intact. A female adherent is a Muslima. The plural form in Arabic is Muslim or Muslim, and its feminine equivalent is Muslimt. The Arabic form Musliman is the stem for participle of the triliteral SLM. The ordinary word in English is Muslim. It is sometimes transliterated as Muslim, which is an older spelling. The word Mosalman is a common equivalent for Muslim used in Central and South Asia. Until at least the mid-1960s, Many English language writers used the term Mohammedans or Mohammedans. Although such terms were not necessarily intended to be pejorative, Muslims argue that the terms are offensive because they allegedly imply that Muslims worship Muhammad rather than God. Other obsolete terms include Muslimite and Muslimist. Musulman slash Mosalman is a synonym for Muslim and is modified from Arabic. It is the origin of the Spanish word musulman, the German musulman, the French word musulman, the Polish words musulmanin and musulmanski, the Portuguese word musulmano, the Italian word musulmano or musulmano, the Romanian word musulman and the Greek word mu omicron upsilon sigma omicron upsilon lambda mu nu omicron.
In English it was sometimes spelled Musulman and has become archaic in usage. Apart from Persian, Spanish, Polish, Portuguese, Italian, and Greek, the term could be found, with obvious local differences, in Armenian, Dari, Pashto, Urdu, Hindi, Bengali, Marathi, Punjabi, Turkish, Kazakh, Uzbek, Kyrgyz, Azeri, Maltese, Hungarian, Czech, Bosnian, Bulgarian, Russian, Serbian, Ukrainian, Romanian, Dutch, and Sanskrit. The Muslim philosopher Ibn Arabi said, A Muslim is a person who has dedicated his worship exclusively to God. Islam means making one's religion and faith gods alone. The Quran describes many prophets and messengers within Judaism and Christianity, and their respective followers, as Muslim, Adam, Noah, Abraham, Ishmael, Jacob, Moses, and Jesus and his apostles are all considered to be Muslims in the Quran. The Quran states that these men were Muslims because they submitted to God, preached his message and upheld his values, which included praying, charity, fasting and pilgrimage. Thus, in Surah 352 of the Quran, Jesus' disciples tell him, We believe in God, and you be our witness that we are Muslims. In Muslim belief, before the Quran, God had given the Torah to Moses, the Zabur to David and the Injil to Jesus, who are all considered important Muslim prophets. The most populous Muslim-majority country is Indonesia, home to 12.7% of the world's Muslims, followed by Pakistan, Bangladesh, and Egypt. About 20% of the world's Muslims lives in the Middle East and North Africa. Sizable minorities are also found in India, China, Russia, Ethiopia, the Americas, Australia, and parts of Europe. The country with the highest proportion of self-described Muslims as a proportion of its total population is Morocco. Converts and immigrant communities are found in almost every part of the world. Over 75-90% of Muslims are Sunni. The second and third largest sects, Shia and Ahmadiyya, make up 10-20% and 1% respectively. With about 1.6 billion followers, almost a quarter of Earth's population, Islam is the second largest and the fastest growing religion in the world. Due primarily to the young age and high fertility rate of Muslims, with Muslim having a rate of compared to the world average of. According to the same study, religious switching has no impact on Muslim population, since the number of people who embrace Islam and those who leave Islam are roughly equal. A Pew Center study in 2016 found that Muslims have the highest number of adherents under the age of 15 of any major religion, while only 7% are aged 60 plus. According to the same study, Muslims have the highest fertility rates of any major religious group. The study also found that Muslims have the lowest average levels of education after Hindus, with an average of 5.6 years of schooling. About 36% of all Muslims have no formal schooling and Muslims have the lowest average levels of higher education of any major religious group, with only 8% having graduate and postgraduate degrees.